so beach patch i'm wrapping up my day my husband is about to go out but i just been sitting here crying i done came up with like a a new family schedule i'm gonna go home and finish it and i got that little break but now i gotta go be like a full-time mom i mean for the most part i've been present all week i haven't been anywhere like gambling all week but it's different it's like I'm gonna just go be a mom. My one-on-ones are later tonight. So I think I'm gonna take the kiddos to the park. And then once we're done at the park, watch movies, like give them, give them baths, watch movies. And then it'll be time for my one-on-ones. And then tomorrow I wanna take the kids to either Universal Studios or SeaWorld. We haven't been to neither in a while. You guys know that we're annual pass holders. We just haven't been because I've been having to work and my husband goes out on Fridays. He typically come home, comes home really, really late. And then the next day he's tired, you know, but tomorrow my goal, I want to leave home at like 6 a.m. So I'm going to wake everybody up at like 5, like it's a school day, leave home at 6 a.m. because it's going to take me about two hours to get to Orlando. I'm going to pack everybody's stuff tonight, but my last one-on-one -on -one end at 11. I be putting myself through it, don't I? Everything just be like back to back. So the way my mind is processing this, my last one on one is at 11. Right now, it's about to be six. My husband is leaving late. It's like six, so seven actually. Um, but I'm thinking, okay, I'm gonna go home. I'm gonna get everybody, take everybody to the park, let them play for like an hour, 30 minutes to an hour, go get ice cream and stuff. Then after that, come home, start baths, watch a movie for a little bit. It should be like 8.30, 9 o'clock. And then by 9.30, okay, guys, I'm going to my room to go to work. And then I'm going to go to work. They should go to sleep. And then I'm going to go to sleep at probably like 12 or 1. I got to, you know, bathe and stuff. And then tomorrow I'll be ready. I'm going to get everybody close together tonight. It's like I'm happy. I'm a little bit of one because like, oh my God, I be doing so much. But at the same time, I'm happy. We used to get up and go to Disney. Like we used to Disney at 6 a.m. and be there at 7 at Magic Kingdom. I cannot wait to go to Disney. We're going in November. That's my kids' Christmas presents, their annual Disney pass again. And then we'll start back going to Disney weekly. This is what my stomach look like, y'all. I'm getting more scratch marks up top of it. Yeah, I just feel like more like focused i'm gonna be waking up i decided my wake up time gonna start to be 3 a.m i typically only need about five hours of sleep so 11 12 1 2 3 if i go to sleep by 11 at night every single night i'll be good i shouldn't crash wake up at 3 edit upload get all this stuff out the way take the kids to school because to me i feel like my husband does a good job taking them but he's not as nurturing and patient like i want my kids to have my love i want them to have my nurturing my patience and stuff and then next week i'm gonna start going back to school lunch like i got this i got i know what to do i know what to do and i'm gonna be dropping long videos every day i'm gonna be dropping short videos every day i had a big goal i'm not gonna share this number with y'all the goal for last month i did not hit my goal y'all know last month i want to make a half a million dollars i didn't do it um this month the number is in my head i'm not gonna share it out loud but it's november you know <laughs> it's november and our next check because content creators for those of you who don't know we get paid a month behind so the checks that i'm gonna get in november right now are it's my money from october and the money i'm gonna get in december which is my christmas check will be all the money i get from all the money I get from November. So it's like, I gotta make sure I go really, really hard, but I still gotta give my husband a break because, you know, even though this week I feel like, hey, I was with them just as much. I, hold up, I was with kids a lot. I'm still gonna just, you know, give him his break, let him enjoy his life because I know how that is. Now, when am I gonna get to enjoy my life and get my break? I don't know. I know like, a video that helped me be okay with moments like this, it was a mom on TikTok. I don't know her name. It was a white mom. She got a lot of kids. And she said it's only for a season. This was about, I want to say, two years ago. 
So at different moments in my life, I have different seasons. This current season of my life, my kids need to be my focus. My kids need me. They need my hugs, my kisses, my encouragement, my wisdom, my help with homework, my help with household stuff. They need my nurturing. And I want to be there in this season for that. I'm still going to gamble, but I already have gambling videos. Like, I didn't upload really any gambling videos last month, and I did gamble and I did record. So I'm going to edit my gambling videos. I'm going to upload those. And then I still have shopping videos. Like, I have, I have the content. So it's like, it's nothing to worry about. Just wake up at 3, edit, upload, do all that stuff. Then after that, go be a mom. I may still offer one-on-ones. Like, I got one-on-ones tonight that text me today. I may still offer one-on-ones, but it'll probably be, like, during my kids' school hours. I say I'm not working after 5, starting next week. And then I know for sure I'm not working this weekend because I haven't been anywhere with my kids in so long. I cannot wait. All right, that's my spiel. Let me get home.